Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today I'm here with another anime movie reaction. And today I'm going to react to Lupin 3 The Castle of Cagliostro. Now, like, I'll tell this in the beginning, I have no idea, like, you know, I have not seen Lupin. You know, I've heard about him a lot because obviously, like, Lupin is very popular character. And uh, I've not seen, like, you know, the show in itself, but, like, I asked some people and they said that it's perfectly fine to watch this movie without having any context about Lupin. And like the main reason why I'm watching and reacting to this, even though I've not watched Lupin, is because this is a <coughs> Miyazaki film. And me, like, you know, I love Ghibli movies. It's, it's one of the best things that I've ever seen, you know, Ghibli movies. Like, the stories were so great. So that's why, like, I thought that I have to watch this and react to this. Because, like, I don't know, like, even though like, I have no idea what, like, you know, or, like, all these characters, like, I know the characters. Like, I'm, I know Lupin and I think there's this girl called Fujiko Mine. These two characters I know very well because I think they came in Detective Conan once, had a, like, a little, like, collaboration thing. And uh, I watched Detective Conan. And, <clears throat> like, from that I got to know them and obviously from other, like, you know, sources and all. Uh, I know them, but that's it like nothing else. I know Lupin is a thief, you know, like that's the extent But still I'm reacting to this because this being a Miyazaki film and I I love them, you know, so that's why I had to check this out and uh, Let's see what this like, you know movie is about and Like, you know, I'm sure I love this movie because as I said, it's a Miyazaki <laughs> Miyazaki movie and I have full faith in it so yeah so yeah uh, without further ado let's get started with this movie uh, this is lupin 3 the cal uh, the castle of caliostro so i think this is very old isn't it just like just a sec let me just check once um yeah 1979 wow very old all right so let's get started so without further ado let's get started with this movie and i'll be putting the subtitles and the timer here thank you to whichever is your preference and let's get started Alright, so here's the countdown. 3, 2, 1, go. <clears throat> oh, this is Lupin, isn't it? <laughs> Casino. Oh! Wow, this, yeah, definitely this is an older, like, you know, oh, <laughs> I think they did that, didn't they? Oh my God. Wow, they did the preparations. Is this car all right? Maybe not. Yeah. Oh, what's written there? Thanks. <laughs> Wow. Wow, they're filled with cash. Five billion. <laughs> okay, don't crash. What? What's the matter? What? Oh, counterfeit. All of this, yeah. So they were ready for them. Counterfeit. Oh, his name is Jigen, okay. <laughs> wow. Oh my god, people stop and try to... Wait, no one is stopping and trying to pick them up? Wow. Hmm. Oh, 
this is a very nostalgic animation style you know because as i said i watched detective conan and i've been watching it from like you know the beginning like i remember like when i was small it used to come in our television detective conan and i used to watch it you watch it you know i was very small at that time and the animation style like you know of detective conan in the first episodes you know in the first couple of episodes not couple but first hundreds two hundreds of episodes Oh my god, this has really reminded me of, of that time. Oh, so these two are like a team, okay. Lupin and Jigen. Nice. Okay, let's. Oh, what is this? Caliostro. Oh, there you go. <laughs> the disguise. <laughs> nice. Wow. <laughs> and there you go. 3500. Okay. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> Okay, so that's why. <laughs> I'm scared so I'll take a nap. Oh! Flat tire. Damn. Is he still sleeping? <laughs> oh god. Do, we have, do they have a spare? Oh, they're there. <laughs> ah, Lupin won. Jigen will have to do it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> He's sitting on top of it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, very peaceful. Hmm? Oh no. Oh god, what's this? Um, you're going to crap. Wait! Wait, what? Oh! <laughs> He's like, oh my god, that's. This is a. Oh! <laughs> oh my god, they have a nitrous booster in their car. Wow! Is she like running away from a wedding ceremony or something? She has like a wedding dress. <laughs> True. Oh God. All right. Oh God. Okay, shoot the tires. Oh no. Okay, all right, shoot. Oh my God, bulletproof tires. Oh, it's a pipe bomb. Oh God. Oh God. <laughs> nice, oh God. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Just like a, you know, the, the video game, like, a car changed. Alright. 
Or you know, not on piercing bullet or something. Whoa! There you go. Exploding bullet or something. <laughs> oh. Nice. Okay, who? <laughs> Wait, oh no, she's unconscious. Oh god. Oh. Okay, like he'll have to go there, grab her, and come back again. It's a tough thing. Or, or you can just okay. I, I'm dumb. Sorry. Oh God. Yeah. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh okay. Oh no, that log looks very flimsy. It, it might, it might break anytime. Okay, it might break anytime. I don't. Yeah, she looks like a princess. Um, d don't. Yeah. Look, look down. <laughs> Imagine waking up to something like this. <laughs> okay, what is that? Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh! Oh my god! <laughs> uh, where's Jigen? No, uh, now what? Oh no. Oh god, what's that? Yeah, they're, they're looking for her. Oh god. Okay, there he is. <laughs> oh, they caught her. Wait. Did they catch her? Oh, wait. Oh. Okay. I'm guessing it's some kind of like I don't know symbol for reality or something. Who knows? Yeah, must be. Okay. Oh yeah, there you go. The symbol. Wait, he kn knew that? That this is this comes from here? He's familiar with this place or something. Hmm. 
fire. Grand Duke's Palace. Oh no, his. Oh, so I'm guessing she's. She, she's a kid from. Regent, okay. Okay, as I said, he, she, she is royalty, that means. And maybe, like, as I said, the regent, maybe they're trying to get her so that, I don't know, get, get the, because she's the original, like, you know, heir of the place. So that's why I'm guessing they're trying to get her. Her being the descendant of the king, uh, must be the reason why. Yeah, so old. Okay, here you go. I was saying that he must know her. Like she was acting too familiar here. So I'm guessing he knew the king and the queen or something. <laughs> what? What is? That? <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh god <laughs> straight to the point wow Oh damn, this is amazing. Yeah, okay, the regent. Down. Oh, yeah. Okay, more than 10 years ago. Oh. <laughs> what is that? Airplane? Auto gyro. Hmm. Jodo. Okay, yeah, she's wearing a wedding dress. Wow, he's just walking and he's... <laughs>
<laughs> wow. Oh, who is this? Oh, I'm guessing her secretary or something. Yeah. What is the nose? Whoa. Oh, this must be her room. Yeah. Wow, this room. <laughs> Just look at it. Um, hello? Oh yeah, she lost the ring. What, what happens with the ring when he, some kind of, there must be some other significance of the ring. So I'm guessing she deliberately put it in the, yeah, yeah, must be. Oh no, she, oh, okay, her ring was in, in her hand. So when he took the gloves out, I'm guessing the ring kind of got pulled out of it. She deliberately did not do it, most probably. Yeah, MD seven, uh, 17. Capron. 15, oh yeah, 15, 17, okay. Roman number. <laughs> oh my god, that guy, that guy's... That guy, he must be a spy or something. Okay, the, her name's Clarice. Oh god, yeah, well... This guy's spying. I don't think that's the only problem here, but you know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> The guy thought that, okay, I did a good job spying, but nope. His cover was out from the beginning. Light and shadow are joined. Wait, someone's coming. Yeah. God. <laughs> <laughs> they have a like a... Okay. Woo! You're in for a surprise. Oh! Oh god! That was a decoy. My god, there are a lot of them. Yeah, there are a lot of them here. Okay, this is a problem. God damn, they're like ninjas. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> nice. Okay, run. <laughs> oh god 
Ah, yeah, that must have hurt. All right. Oh my god, what is that? Oh god, what what's she doing? Is she some kind of a... She looks like she's doing some kind of... You know, secret work. Whoa! Yeah, they're doing the counterfeit. Oh god. Oh no. Oh, okay, it was him. Thank god. What's that in her- in his- oh my god, did they- Did they just sneakily put that? <laughs> oh. Wait, she is this Fujiko? <laughs> he is not <laughs> his eyes twitching. So I'm guessing the shadow and the light means those two rings, I'm guessing. Most probably. You know, when they come together, the, the, the guy was kind of putting his ring on, like, you know, on the girl's finger, doing something like that. I'm bringing them close, so I'm guessing something must happen. Oh, I think this is another character from the Rupan series, isn't she? He, he's like the samurai or something? I don't know his name, but I've seen him. Yeah, he's like a samurai. Yeah, it must be. Let's see. Okay, what's his name? Oh, it's Goemon! Well, Goemon, like, like not, obviously not Ishikawa Goemon. Ishikawa Goemon is like the gentleman thief, isn't he? I think they took the name from that. Zenigata. Oh, so is, is this a police officer that... Yeah, I'm guessing. So he's also a character from Lupin. Alright. Oh, <laughs> look at that. <laughs> so, so elegant. Okay, did, did he hire him? Yeah. Oh, he's the grand son of Arsene Lupin. <laughs> oh, these guys. Damn, he's big. Good stuff. <laughs> this guy is doing counterfeit money things, and he's. <laughs> So smug in front of a police officer, damn. Oh wow, okay, that's right. <laughs> totally different to his work. Oh my god. The surveillance they're under, like you know? Okay. Hmm. 
Whoa, traps! Anti personnel radar. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Oh, is, does he something have in his? Dirty old man. Anti tank rifle. <laughs> tank. Wait, he. Oh, use poison to fight poison. Wow. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yep. Oh! <laughs> Damn, this is like a first obstacle. Wow, they're ready with all the oxygen tanks and everything. The, what do you call that? Uh, the rebreather or something. <clears throat> you know the thing that you use to breathe underwater? Wow, this looks... Oh, the sucking... Oh, God. <laughs> oh. Wow, he is... Oh, no! Ah. Oh, no, he can't do it. Oh, God. Ugh! Oh. I hope he doesn't get crushed or something. Oh my god. Okay. He's okay. Oh! Wow, they have traps here as well. Great. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, he is all right. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Fancy. <laughs> <They're eating. laughs> okay. Oh, what's happening? Uh, we, they, they're bringing something else now. Oh my god, he, he's catching. Oh god. Ha! Wait. Oh no. Damn, the... It, they would have he would have gotten caught if he came out a little bit earlier <laughs> pull out at once oh god yeah they're pulling strings i guess this is kind of not as like as you know like Lupin brought them because he needs them to do their thing. Yeah. <laughs> nope. 
orders from the top. Oh, oh is that the disguise? Oh, Gustav is here. He's blatantly saying that. Yeah. Orientals. Wow. Will he really go back just like that? Let's see. <laughs> Look at that smirk. <laughs> Wait! <laughs> that was Lupin! I did not even see that! Oh, maybe this is Lupin! No, no, this is Lupin! He's tricking them! <laughs> nice! <laughs> the, the royal guards are stupid because they they are accompanied by the police officers like you know so obviously he's not lupin oh god Okay, some kind of trap must be here. I'm sure about it. Oh no, oh no. Oh no! Oh, <laughs> oh my god. I hope there's... Like, you know? Oh. Oh, did he deactivate it? Yeah. Nice. Wow. Ah, uh, nice. Oh. oh my god, fantastic. Wow. <laughs> oh god, this is great. This must be Fujiko. I'm sure about it. Oh! There you go. <laughs> Wait, he's gone. Whoa. Okay, he's up. Oh, yeah. 
Oh. Oh. Oh no. He, he like didn't he have that gadget to kind of like you know that thing. I'm guessing like it's probably difficult. Okay, there you go. Yeah, he was unable to like you know do it because there are no proper place to hold that. Okay, what's he going to do from here? Is he going to like jump or something? Like does he have a gliding? Oh my god, what is that? It's like a rocket thingy. Oh. Oh. Oh no, the lighter. Oh no. Oh no. It, it, it must have been like in the, the, he was in water, so I'm guessing. No! Oh no! Oh no! Ah! Oh god, he has to like... Oh no, 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 no. Oh! Okay, what now, what now? Oh my god, the momentum. The momentum, he needs to stop. Oh! <laughs> well, that helped. But he needs to get up now, okay. Oh no. But how will he even... Okay, there you go. Nice. Oh. <laughs> He's going to show up in the window or something. Okay. Oh, he, he got in from there. Okay. A <laughs> tree. <Jeez. laughs> <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Mm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Set her free. <laughs> wow. What? Well... <laughs> oh 
What? 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 What's that? What was this? My power is unleashing. Oh my god, something's. What the? <laughs> wow. Okay. Okay, I hope. Yeah. Well, time to bounce. Okay, maybe not. Oh no. Yeah, okay. These guys are pretty pretty tough. They're like uh Oh. <laughs> there comes the boss. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he himself can, you know. <laughs> what the hell? Yeah. Damn, he didn't even flinch. Well, he has his gadgets, so I don't think that will work. Okay, what is with that ring? Like, you know, like, as I said, like, the shadow and the light, if they converge, something will happen. Some kind of treasure or something. I think the shadow and the light kind of denotes the rings. Yeah. Oh, God. Wow. Shadow. Oh, okay. Goat. Light has been said. Oh, there you go. Oh, the two houses. Okay, the light and the shadow, as they said, like he works as the shadow. Silver goat. Wait, wh what is it? Wait, wait, is that like a bug? Like, <laughs> oh no. <laughs> wow, nice. Yeah! <laughs> okay, I, I should have saw that coming. Like, obviously he won't return that so easily. Because it's like the only the trump card he has. <laughs> no. <laughs> He's like, oh my god, I have to go in there? 
Yeah, we'll see. Yeah. Wow, these are like the dead bodies, damn, or, or, or something else. No, these are dead bodies. Wow. As I said, it's like a land of the dead. All skeletons and everything. So how do you get out of this place? Oh, wait. Oh, damn, that's a... That's a crown. Genosuke Kawakami, spy for the Japanese army, met his end. Avenge me. Oh, no, they're coming. Okay, there you go. Oh, oh no, this is, um, what was his name? I forgot. <laughs> okay, calm down. Not here. <laughs> Both of them are doomed. Yeah, let's chill here. <laughs> nah. Hmm. Well, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, where are the others, Guemon and Jigen? Where, where are they? Like, there you go, there he is. Okay. Okay. Oh, these are the people. I'm sure they're like, you know, they're here for confirming their demise. Are they like acting or some, something like acting to be asleep or dead? I'm sure about it. Yeah, they're acting. They're going to jump on him. Let's see. Okay. <laughs> nice. <laughs> They only let <laughs> they only let in three people here. That was the biggest mistake. Okay, go and catch him. Like if he goes and oh no. Oh no, his, his... Okay, there you go. Okay, got him. Nice. <laughs> wow. 
Okay, now, now they'll take the disguise and... Nice! <laughs> oh my god! Amazing! <laughs> well, yeah, but... Whoa, look at this place. I'm oh, these are like the machines, the counterfeit printing machines, something like that. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> yep, they hit the jackpot. Yeah, these are the counterfeit ones. Wait, he didn't realize? Wow, they have... They even have rupees! <laughs> Damn! Yeah. Supposedly better than the original, the gold bills. Oh. Okay. I don't know. Is this all like that actually happened in history? I'm not sure about it. I don't know about these. I think so. Well, arrest them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nah, he's only going to steal one thing. <laughs> I won't be corrupted. <laughs> oh god. Oh, I mean, Fujiko is here. Well, she, whoa, he, she knows about her. Oh, okay, she doesn't know. Oh. Oh, are they doing that? Oh, there you go. This, the signal. All right. <laughs> Whoa, this is a, it's coming from the statue as well. Well, there you go. Are they burning the notes or something? Yeah! Whoa. Evidence. Oh no. <laughs> well. Wait, did they find the evidence? Oh my god. <laughs> Run! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yes! 
<laughs> oh god damn. Okay, there you go. All right. Hop in. Whoa. Yeah, yeah, get in. Get in. God. Yeah. This <laughs> isn't <in> business. <laughs> oh my god. Don't worry. He <laughs> okay. Yeah, don't worry. They're, they're going to. Okay. Oh. Fujiko. Oh my god. She's tossing a grenade. <laughs> Will that work? Nope. Bulletproof. Now what? What? Oh! Oh no, they're, they're coming. <laughs> Take over. Ah, you'll manage. Okay, quick. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Another nade. <laughs> okay. Another grenade. Damn, he's handling it proper pretty well, you know? For someone who has not flied a plane or auto guy or whatever. Okay, don't no. Oh 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 no, what the Wait, who shot that? Oh god. Oh no! Wait, who shot that? Oh god, this guy. Wow, they're surrounded. Oh god! Wait, wh what? Like, going on? I I'm guessing they should come very soon. Great. Ah, no, you, 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 Wow. Okay, there he is. I was thinking, where did he go to? Alright, run. Not, yeah, nothing you can do now, like. Oh, no.
Okay, there. <laughs> yeah. God damn. <laughs> I got to watch this whole thing. I think that's that's like a cash phrase of something. I, I can't remember like mata sumaran mono kitte shimatta. I think it's I have heard that somewhere before. Okay, he got his evidence, thank god. But he has, like, you know, connections from the inside. Yeah. Okay, well... Wow! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Damn. Wow, they're fighting against each other. Hmm. Oh. Oh god. Oh, so is that guy? Yeah. Oh. Wait, I'm I think like like Lupin came here in in his like you know when he was younger, so I'm guessing the dog knows him from that or something. I think so. Yeah, there you go. Like as he said, he came here before, so he knows um Oh. Well. Wait. Oh, maybe. Like he knew the Clarissa's. Okay, he he is remembering everything. Three, damn. <laughs> Bring me food. Haha. <laughs> 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 Don't eat so fast. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Oh no, don't don't throw up. Uh <laughs> Okay. Oh, okay. Hmm. Yeah, he he knows them from the past, so. Yeah. Ten years. <laughs> He's vacuuming it up. Hmm. Wow. Oh God. Oh, the dog found him. Okay. Cla Clarice must have been here. There you go. Yeah. Mm. Oh god, someone's here. What the? Oh, that was pretty good. <laughs> oh, <laughs> opportunity. <laughs> Let's go kidnap that. Okay. <laughs> I'm off the cat. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Well, that really helped them, both of them. Like now they have the opportunity. Wow, it's like, oh God. <laughs> They're just sitting and playing. Um, Lupin's coming for you. Ah, there they are. <laughs> yeah, there is one way. Let's go. Definitely. Oh my god, they got stuck here. <laughs> wow. Damn, look at the crowd. Oh, it's Fujiko. <laughs> mm. Wow. Yes, he has arrived. Let's see. Ah, there he is. <laughs> and there, little dead. <laughs> Jigen. <laughs> he has already come. <laughs> oh my god.
Whoa, what a... Oh, they were saying something about, you know, the shadow of the palace and the goat. Wait, what happened to her? This is Clarice, isn't it? Or maybe not. Yeah, that's Clarice. What happened to her eyes? She, she look, her eyes looks vacant. Okay, I think that's Fujiko, isn't it? that on top? And these are like the guards that are guarding the. Is that Fujiko? Who is that? On top? And there he is. There are the rings. Mm, I think it was. Wait, I thought the Archbishop was open. Am I mistaken? Okay, maybe. Yeah, yeah, that is open, isn't it? Yeah. That is open. I, I think so. Oh, God. What the? Wait. Wait. Wait, is that like a decoy or something? I think this is Rupan, isn't it? Dodge Bishop. That's not Rupan. I don't know. Let's see. Oh, that must be some kind of dummy. I can feel it. Like they're kind of carrying it, you know? And that's Fujiko. There you go. Well, it won't work. That's not too fun. <laughs> and... <laughs> there you go.
some money. Oh my god, the counterfeit bills. <laughs> In front of the camera. But the camera was like shut down, so. <laughs> Run! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god <laughs> Okay, now it's time for Jigen and Goemon to do that thing There you go Oh my god, let's see <laughs> He's Wow Nice And they're also here there you go. Nope. <laughs> wow, this has been like broadcasted to the whole world. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> 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 yeah, it's too late. Yeah, what is this? Yeah. <laughs> what a terrible... <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, like I just like happened to be here, you know? Definitely not deliberate. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Concentrate. <laughs> he wore the thing. <laughs> nice. Wow. Okay. Hmm. Wow, that's huge. Wait. Yeah. It's an inscription like that. Place me in its eyes. <clears throat> okay. Oh boy.
Oh my god. Oh great, they're here again. <laughs> oh my god, it got stuck in his... <laughs> oh! Oh! Oh my god! Yeah! Run! Okay. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. Damn. You're gonna crush them completely. <laughs> okay. Ah. Oh, God. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Come on. Damn, it's very... There you go. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it got completely blocked. There you go. Oh god, this guy is here. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Damn. Oh. <laughs> and bam. Nice. Okay, this time oh 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 oh. Okay. Gaggy. Oh. Oh, 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 God. Yeah, now what? Yeah, yeah, run. Okay. Oh god. Oh my god, this is a clock. Okay. I hope this thing is not rusted or something, or it might break us. Oh, don't, then you go, won't get the rings. Oh, you need to insert it there. Yeah.
Okay, he let it down over there. Now what? Okay, I think he must have some kind of plan. Let's see. Yeah, like don't. Great. Yeah, we knew this guy's like that, so. Well, I'm sure he also has some ace up his sleeve. Let's see, there must be something that he did. Oh! God damn. Ugh. Okay. Let's see, I'm sure Lupin, Lupin had some kind of plan. Like, I doubt he just said the actual secret. There must be something else. Okay. Oh, the clock is starting to tick or something. What? I think so. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> well, um, ah, uh, oh, that's the end. Yeah, what's happening? What is the actual secret? <sighs> Whoa. Wait, self-destruction? Is that the actual... So, so it was like a self-destruct button or something? Yeah. Oh, the water is coming in. It's completely drowning the... Okay, so yeah, basically it was that that means like it was like a, like a switch or something that would completely destroy the place. Wow, look at that. <laughs> no treasure, like, you know, like imagine like doing so, so many things and just seeing something like this happening at the end. You know, he did so many things, went to so, such lengths. And died in the end. Oh wow, okay, this looks really pretty. Yeah, it got submerged.
not completely but you know half of it wow the hidden treasure oh this this place got was submerged and it all right all right okay 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 so this is the actual treasure all right <laughs> too big for my pocket yeah <laughs> So it has like an archaeological, like, you know, value, a huge value. Like literally a treasure. What the? Oh, uh, yeah. Well. <laughs> Well, yeah. yeah he he does a lot of dangerous things so i doubt he'll be able to Okay. <laughs> yeah. No, he didn't. Yeah. What? What? <laughs> okay, that's one of the. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, he she still didn't realize it. Yeah, he won't do that. What? Oh my god, she got the plates. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, she... He, he still has the crown <laughs> in his head.
Wow. Okay, that's the end, I'm guessing. Wow, that's really nice. Such a great... Okay, that's the end. Such a great movie. Okay, yeah. Obviously, like, uh, like, obviously, I, I could understand everything. Like, there's no, like, you did not need any prior knowledge to see this. Most probably, I missed a few things, uh, you know, which, uh, like, I probably would have gotten if I've seen Lupin before. For example, uh, the whole thing with uh, Goemon, like, they said something about Goemon having some kind of problem with ladies. I'm not sure about that. There must be some kind of backstory regarding him, which we get to know in the anime, you know, like, from that most probably so like these kind of things or maybe there are a few other references from like you know from other like from the anime or something which i probably did not get but otherwise it was like it was very easy to understand nothing like you know you do not do not need any prior knowledge to see this and like i had a little bit of uh background like i knew about a few characters for example Rupan. obviously we knew about him like i knew about him and fujiko like these two characters i knew about and i've seen jigen before but i uh, did not know his name and Goemon also I saw his character before but did not know his name so his name is uh, Goemon he's okay his name is Ishikawa th 13 Goemon okay so he's like uh, the ancestor of the actual Ishikawa Goemon I'm guessing like you know the the thief uh, Ishikawa Goemon the gentleman thief I think they call them call him and uh, like I did not know about Zenigata, but obviously, like in a, like in a, in a show like this, you definitely need a police officer, you know, who will be like the recurring character. So he was that. And uh, yeah, okay. One thing that I'm quite curious about is just a second. Like the the thing. Mm, okay, I cannot find it. Like. okay uh the thing that i'm quite like i'm trying to find is uh the the quote that goemon said like mata uh what did he say uh like i cut down another useless thing mata kudaranai mono kitte shimatta like i think i've heard that before like like if you guys know where it like if it is something from this show in itself or if it is some kind of reference to some other thing like let me know because I think I've heard that line before. Like you know, mata kudaranai mono kitte shimaimashita. Like I cut down another useless thing. I, I think most probably it is an original quote of this show, like you know, Lupin, and some other anime kind of like you know parodied it from where I have heard it before. That's why I think like uh, like you know after hearing that uh, quote, I feel like I've heard it before from somewhere. Most probably, like that's what happened because Lupin is very old. You know, it's a very old show. So most probably like me hearing like this quote from some other anime means that anime probably like, you know, uh, parodied this, like, you know, this anime, something like that. Who knows? So like, and I, I cannot find it. Like I, I'm searching it in like, you know, in the internet, but like I cannot find that uh, the quote. Nope. Okay, here it is. Once again. Yeah, it is a quote from uh, Lupin. It is Goemon's quote. So, like, most probably, you know what happened? Like, uh, obviously, I've not watched Lupin before. This is the first time. Like, you know, first something that I'm watching that is related to Lupin. So, most probably what happened is i saw an anime which probably kind of parodied this line you know like kind of said this line as a parody or something so like it was such a cool word like you know such a cool quote that i remembered it <laughs> and now we're getting it here uh, who knows most probably gintama you know because i i've seen gintama like gintama pro most probably like gintama like does all these parodies i i think most probably i've heard this line from gintama somewhere because like you know get, like <laughs> Gintama <laughs> parodies every anime that is in existence. So I'm sure it's some like you know somewhere down the line it kind of parodied Lupin as well. So like I, I think most probably I've heard this quote from there. 
and it kind of stuck in my mind and now i can hear like you know i'm hearing it here so something like that most probably right so this movie um <clears throat> I love the movie this was so like like i could feel like you know the uh, vibe of like you know like uh, the miyazaki movies have a vibe and like it also had this like you know this, this calm feeling like you know such great like it, it gives very much attention to the surroundings as well the surroundings the peacefulness you know but at the same time like like stuff are going down at the same time for example lupin got shot but like you know before that we were seeing this kind of a scenery where it was so calm and quiet like you know everyone was kind of sitting down and like it had like a tranquil vibe like all of these things and the story was definitely great <clears throat> like you know like it was like uh uh what do you call it the uh, like an, not an adventure but a, like a princess story kind of in a way where like a princess is being caught and kind of like you know get held captive and the person like you know the main character comes and saves her something like that and <clears throat> with a twist here obviously because like <laughs> this is no <laughs> you know prince on a white horse this is uh like you know beloved uh thief lupin and <clears throat> yeah and um like another thing that i uh, like you know like that we saw here is that i was a little bit surprised you know was the end of the guy uh, what was his name the count uh Mm, let me check his name what are, uh the, the 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 bad guy you know <laughs> like him like his end i was really not surprising him like you know as, uh, like i was really not expecting him to die like you know like they obviously did not show us they kind of showed like you know let us hear the sound effect but like you know like uh i think i think this is like a kids movie like this is kind of uh like you know aimed towards kids and adults at the same time so like seeing something like this i don't okay uh, maybe like you know like maybe it's not a big problem because i doubt anyone will like you know like kids at this age will be able to understand what actually happened at that moment because they did not show us anything like it, it's implied that he died and that was a little bit surprising i was really not expecting like you know something like that but he got what he deserved and <clears throat> Like he did a lot of bad things he, he like you know he was trying to kill lupin and at the same time he was trying to kill uh clarice so yeah like if you try to kill someone you should also be prepared to be killed yourself like that's like you know like that's one thing that we should keep in mind that whatever we try to do to others we should also be prepared for the same thing to be done to us so if you don't want something to be done to yourself don't do that to other people like that's like one of the biggest thing that people should keep in mind and he like he did his own like you know things he 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 was a bad character he like you know he he did a lot of like the whole counterfeit business lying kind of like you know deceiving people and killing people all of these things he did and he got what is what he deserved karma so yeah and uh, like i really loved it like i like i had plans for reacting to lupin itself you know because i i don't think i've seen any person like you know, any reactor reacting to lupin but due to like you know like uh, the lack of time and everything and i because i do not get a proper like you know like obviously because lupin is i'm i'm, I'm guessing lupin is a very big type of an anime like it's like you know like those long running animes i think so like there are a lot of seasons so like i have to like you know like choose a time where i would be able to dedicate myself you know to properly watch this show for you know react to this show for a like you know a long amount of time for example probably it'll take probably like a year or something to completely react to dupan so like that's why like you know i i'm not getting that time proper time to actually do that so that's why like it's always like you know being kept in like you know like i i want to react to it but i cannot so let's see like you know if i get enough free time like uh time enough to dedicate myself to this show i might start reacting to lupin because i really want to check this out and it really looks such a great anime you know like especially like it has like as i said like it has the vibe of those like <clears throat> old shows which uh for example as i said like detective conan like this really like you know reminded me of the time when i watched detective conan when i was a child 
and you know especially the animation style and the story and all like you, you know like the the older movies the older anime movies the older like animes they have a certain type of a vibe a certain type of a storytelling which is very different from animes now now i love animes in the modern generation definitely but i also like that vibe you know like of the like olden like you know older days the anime the vibe that the animes had at that moment so yeah like like that was great and as i said like i i might have missed something which probably needed prior like you know knowledge from the actual lupan anime so like i probably missed a few things some references and stuff but it was very easy to understand you did not need much uh like knowledge prior knowledge about the characters it was pretty self-explanatory after watching this and yeah this is great and like one thing we could like I, I could understand here is excuse me like Lupin he he is very intelligent like you know like the way he tricked them in a lot of ways and like you know like even I myself was unable to properly catch what he's going to do like you know when the time when Jigen uh, not Jigen what was his name the police officer um Zenigata Zenigata uh, the time when Zenigata he like comes to the uh, you know to, to the guards to gustav and says that let me in and he doesn't let him in and he goes back you know and then again like you know zenigata comes and he says that oh what the hell did you do like that was lupan you let him go and i was thinking oh my god so lupan actually tricked them like my mind went completely to him and i i believed what he said same thing happened to the guards the guards also believed what zenigata said and they went following him i also thought that was lupan but then i realized that if that was lupan you know the <laughs> then why are police officers following him and why is this zenigata alone completely so and then it actually clicked i i, I like and you know, i realized that this zenigata might be the actual lupan because he's kind of telling him to go and follow them so that they actually leave their post and he can get in like like these things like you know like it is like a trick on top of a trick and like it was really like you know like good like uh what can i say like like proper use of like you know like quick like quick witted it was very quick witted and yeah that was fantastic okay one thing i'm quite curious about how old is Zupan? Like you know like we saw when he said that uh 10 years ago uh, when i was young uh he seemed pretty like you know he seemed a little younger than the lupin that we're seeing now but he looked pretty much the same so i'm guessing now currently most probably he's 30 34 years old something like that so 10 years ago he was like 24 years old when he actually went to the castle and like you know kind of got trapped in it not trapped but got like you know like injured and clarissa came and like nursed him they like gave him water and stuff so it's most probably something like that and uh, yeah all these characters like you know the the, the recurring characters like as like zenigata goemon uh, fujiko Dais, uh, jigen and lupan like these characters i'm, I'm guessing the, obviously these like lupan is the main character but these characters are like the uh, recurring characters i'm guessing so these characters and like like they were very interesting like it's it really like for example uh, i really liked goemon like you know his style of the whole like you know like samurai style like him kind of cutting everything and that was great and uh, yeah as i said i would love to check this out but like you know i also like i love to react to it as well the actual lupan series but as i said like time i need a proper time and a proper like you know uh length of time to actually dedicate myself to this show so let's see somewhere like you know somewhere in the future i might do it and uh, yeah that was fantastic uh, everything was great uh, the animation definitely uh, the the sound like you know the background music the songs uh, they were great as well and story was definitely amazing as i said like the story had a uh, 
Okay, so let's talk about the treasure. So uh, as far as I could understand, the treasure was something as they said, like it was the Roman, like, you know, ruins that was actually submerged up until now. So when that thing happened, like, you know, when they like activated the mechanism of the tower, uh, the like the water got drained out and it submerged the actual castle. But at the same time, the water that was in the ruins, which was submerging the ruins that went down. So like now they can find the ruins and as they said like yeah this is literally a treasure but it's too big for Lupin's pocket. It's like an archaeological like you know and like a treasure something like that and like it, it has a big value in history and I'm sure like it will be like kind of like you will you know people will come and start actually like you know like draining the remaining water out and like a kind of uh, what do you call that like announce this place as a site like archaeological site or something like you know and like it will be a place of like a historical interest and something like they'll do that definitely i'm sure about it and who knows what will happen to the actual castle of Cagliostro? maybe that will also be like something like that you know they'll, they'll kind of announce it to be an actual archae archaeological history you know historical important place and and this guy, like, you know, the, 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 the guy, the bad guy, he, he wanted, like, you know, he thought that, oh, I'll get money, I'll get treasure and all of these stuff. And, well, karma struck. He, um, you know, he got what he deserved and he wasn't even, like, you know, by the end of it, everything that happened, like, you know, like, he wouldn't be able, able to even be able to, like, actually get that because it's, it's not any actual, like, you know, treasure. It's treasure in a different meaning, like, you know, in a different way. It has historical importance, no like monetary value. So he would have been extremely disappointed if he was alive at that moment. But you know, he died. And like I thought at that moment, Lupin was probably like, you know, kind of tricking him or something, has some kind of thing up his sleeves. But he was genuinely trying to, like, okay, like, yeah, he was genuinely, like, you know, with no tricks, he was actually trying to negotiate with him. But the guy was trash, you know. Like, like, obviously, like, we saw that coming, he wouldn't value the promise, he would just, he was just doing that for the time being, to actually get his hand on the rings. And, yeah, so, that happened. And, uh, yeah, that was great. and oh another thing uh, i don't know like the whole thing with the counterfeit like you know the goat money and uh, like them saying like actually napoleon was being um you know aided by these counterfeit money as well like are these all true are these like actual historical facts i don't know about this you know like they were saying something about like the way they like explained it it, it seemed as if it was true it was the truth you know like they had a lot of facts there which is pretty difficult to kind of like you know make this up so i'm guessing it's based on actual historical facts the whole like counterfeit money they said like the goat and stuff like they kind of like even mentioned the dates and stuff so i'm guessing these actually happen in histo history i'm not sure about it like if you guys know you can let me now know in the comment section so yeah that was it so yeah guys thank you guys for watching this was my reaction to uh lupin 3 the castle of cariostro uh, as i said it was a very like you know fantastic uh, movie obviously like i knew like this will be great because it's directed by miyazaki and uh yeah like i loved like mo like all the ghibli movies that i watched and most of them were kind of like directed by him so like that's why as i said like that's why i was really excited to check this out even though i have not watched lupin myself so and uh, yeah you did not you do not need any kind of prior knowledge to lupin to watch this it's pretty self-explanatory and it's definitely like you know uh, a great uh, a great uh, show a great movie and uh, in the end as we saw like you know like like lupin cannot get out of this whole thing as like you know as uh, in the end, like when Jigen said that you could have stayed, but no, like that's one thing that Lupin cannot do. You know, stability. That's one thing that he'll never get because of his, like you know, the things that he do. He's like, uh, like you know, he kind of 
steal stuff and like i i think like lupin is also kind of like let me just check it like you know um okay arsene lupin 3 is the grandson of arsene lupin he is the world's most wanted thief often in his adventures he takes it upon himself and his gang to foil other criminals engaged in more serious crimes and uh, he uh sometimes appears incompetent but mostly as a charade char char to catch his opponents off guard while he has been arrested and thrown in jail for several occasions he always has managed to break out his infatuation with fujiko mine is probably his biggest weakness that is often lands him in undesirable situations okay yeah so he as, as they say like you know as, as as it's written here that he's like a very he's one wanted thief but like he takes upon himself to actually like foil other criminals who are engaged in more like you know heinous crime more dangerous stuff so it's like something like that like he does like you know he he is a thief but not like that like he is a good thief in a way so something like that so yeah so yeah and uh, that was it like thank you guys for watching this was my reaction to Dupan 3 the castle of Cariostro. if you guys enjoyed my reaction be sure to press the like button and also subscribe if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed comment down below anything you want to say or anything you want to share i'll definitely check them out all right so let me just uh like you know like decide which uh, movie i'll do uh, next week and uh, next week i'm going to react to this movie uh, this is called perfect blue now this is also another very old movie and like as i said like i plan on watching every like you know reacting to every movie there is which will obviously take a lot of time because i do this every week like you know every uh like uh like i do this weekly so it'll definitely take a lot of time but you know like i plan on like watching every movie that there is every anime movie there is and react to it so next week perfect blue that will be like you know the one that i'll be reacting to so yeah see you guys then so thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys in the next week with another anime movie reaction so until then goodbye and have a nice day